the first bite of my first Krispy Kreme donut from Japan, guys. So, it's time for the old fashioned matcha one, guys. I'm super excited for this one. Look at this, guys. Look at this bite. What is up guys and welcome to a new video on my channel. I am Alan 27 Yusang from Germany But before we start this video, it's time for a big change. Try, uh, I really want to do it for a long time So let's cut my hairs and then it's time for a cheat day video <laughs> So here we got my hairs you can see it <laughs> Goodbye. Goodbye, long hairs. Yes, guys, it's time for a change. <laughs> Peace out. Welcome to a new video on my channel. I'm Alan 27 years from Germany right now in Shinjuku. And it's time for a new cheat days and it was not a joke. I cut my hairs, guys. I really cut my hairs. I really want to do it. The humidity here is just too crazy and really too, really too high. But I'm super excited because it's Sunday. So Sunday is my fun day, you know the drill. And I really want to eat just whatever I want to. And just because we got here also a Krispy Kreme. Yes, it's not Japanese, guys, but they got only Japanese available flavors that I really want to try but if you're new to the channel don't forget to subscribe follow me on Instagram to be updated all the time what I do in Japan all the links are down in my description and yes that was all right now it's time to get in just as you can see them they are looking really good, I don't know. I tried them one time in the US or two times or three times, I don't know. But well, let's compare them, just are only available flavors in Japan. But for sure we got also one original glaze that I really want to try and to compare. The first bite of my first Krispy Kreme donut from Japan, guys. So, itadakimasu. Ah, really? Ah, huh. mm. Close to the USA ones. Yeah. Really close. Still warm. Oh, wow. Oh. Mm. Yeah, good. So, guys, right now it's time to the six layers that I, you can get only in Japan. So, let's try out the first. Green brulee one, so you can see it's burnt on the top, it's really hot. So let's see, guys. Cheers! Oh wow, really a hard shell, crispy on the outside, sakuto texture. It's oh, yeah, kind of a little bit burnt flavor, it makes such a difference to normal donuts. It's not normal. Oh. So, kind of uh, berry jam in the middle, some crumbles. This one is kind of dry, it, it's not filled. The glaze tastes like cheesecake. I just did the dishes. Mm. And the jam, it's kind of a raspberry and strawberry jam. A, mix, a mixture. Here we got the salty nuts with caramel donut. And it looks delicious. Oh my god. Cheers guys, let's try it out. Terakimas. Guys, you don't know. Mm. Again, the dough. The caramel and the almonds, everything goes so well together. Mm. Mm. Oh wow. Time for the old fashioned matcha one, guys. I'm super excited for this one. We have to try this definitely because matcha, guys, Japanese donut. Itadakimasu. 
the inside is really bitter like matcha but the glaze is a sweet matcha kind of and it works perfectly together oh my god this is crazy it's not dry and it it's really like a Japanese donut this is really a Japanese donut oh wow really good mm. Mm. Wow. Mm. Now it's time for the cream bully with lemon filling. I'm super excited for this one. And I hope that this is also so crunchy like the first one. This is so freaking delicious. Oh my god. This is so much better than the vanilla filled one. So much better. I wish you can hear the crisp. The sound really like sakko sakko. Really, mm. wow, Damn. Mm. Last but not least, the unbaked cream cheese one, guys. It looks amazing, and it's filled. So we will see how this will taste. I don't know, but it's supposed to be good, like every kind of this donuts. I gotta say, donut, a crispy cream donuts here in Japan is amazing. Really, guys. You have to try it when you're here. It's totally worth it. So let's let's get in. Let's dive in, guys. This feeling, guys, is so freaking amazing. Oh, <laughs> oh wow. Mm. Mm. The perfect start guys from my first meal. So right now it's time to go to Gindaku. It's right next to this Krispy Kreme and let's eat some takoyakis. I really want to try some takoyaki from this place so let's go there strictly. I'm hungry guys so mm. but yeah, just like I said, go to Krispy Kreme Japan, guys. We have to try it out. I will definitely come again. <laughs> 1000%. I saw a place that I really want to try. It's Gindak. And they sell um, takoyaki. This is a chain, but a really good chain. Everybody say, if you want to try some takoyaki, they are not expensive there and they are really good. So let's try them out. It's right on the back. They are piping hot, so be safe, be careful. Oh wow! So delicious. They are so good. Mm. Now as well with some mayo, Japanese mayo, guys. It's so delicious. I hope you can understand everything. It's really loud again, but oh wow. And they got a lot of different takoyakis, but I want to try the original one. So just with bonito flakes and some takoyaki sauce. And yeah, some mayo, because Japanese mayo is amazing. Mm. Oh, it's really perfectly crispy outside, and then again, so gooey in the middle. Mm -hmm. Damn! Everyday fried dough. So, last one, guys. Cheers! And Gindaku, really great job. Mm. Oh wow. Guys, we're at McDonald's. We finally made it. I make my order, and uh, right now, right now, it's time to wait. So 
if you know it's again really loud but we got our goodies is a teriyaki chicken burger beef burger with egg some fries and a cheesecake McFlurry guys the drink a blue Hawaiian drink I don't know what this is but let's try this out first because I'm super thirsty let's try it out It is really sugary, but the taste is amazing. Really tropical flavor and super cold, just delicious. Oh wow. Let's try out some fries. They don't got the shaka fries anymore. I really want to shake it with the, uh, with the flavor, but they don't got them anymore. Maybe next month we will see. Mm. But Oh, wow. Better than in Germany. <laughs> Cheese and egg burger. I ordered without pickles. I hope they make it. Look at this egg, guys, with the cheese. The patty. Ketchup, onions, but no pickles. Perfect. Look at this guys, look at this bite. I gotta say, the egg here is the most important part and you can taste the egg the most. The beef you can taste also but not really. The egg is so over warm and but it's just amazing. I love it. 8.5 out of 10. Now it's time for the teriyaki chicken. So here you can see the deep fried chicken and it's so red just because of all the teriyaki sauce and mayo on a delicious sesame bun. So, itadakimasu! The chicken flavor, wow. Just look at this meat. And this is real meat. Please, USA, Germany, do it like Japan. You can still see the juice from the meat. This is quality. You can see still the juice from all the meat, guys. A little bit less in sauce and then it's perfect. Wow, I love this burger. Maybe because I love fried chicken. Mm. Hell yeah. So guys, here we got the Cheesecake McFlurry. I think this is the Graham crackers and maybe the ice cream tastes like, um, yeah, a cheesecake. We will see. Melted. But we have to end this meal with a dessert. So, let's try it out. I'm super excited for this one because I love cheesecake. So, itadakimasu. Mm. So you definitely have the crust taste from the cheesecake, but the cheesecake better. It tastes more like a Japanese cheesecake. So it's not too sweet. It's it's amazing, really. It's perfect, especially for this time right now. Cake bites and the graham cracker bites. <laughs> Definitely cheesecake. Mm. Uh, 
highly recommend McDonald's in Japan, guys. No joke. That was all. I'm done. I don't know what I will eat next, but stay tuned. Okay guys, it's time for the next spot and I got big cravings for beef over rice. I really want to try this chain for a long time and right now we are at Yoshinoya. It's a Japanese chain and they are famous for the uh, rice bowls, so beef over rice. They got really everything over rice, but I'm really looking for the beef over rice. I heard a lot about it and it has to be good and cheap, so let's see. You saw my bowl, it looks delicious, it looks amazing, it's steam hot, a lot of beef over rice, you become every time free water as much as you want, so you don't have to pay for the drinks. First the beef guys. Mm. Wow. Oh damn, this is so delicious. Perfectly cooked, guys. Perfectly. All the juice from the meat comes into the rice and you can taste it in the rice right now. So really, the whole rice tastes like meat. It's so delicious, oh my god, you don't need anything. This was good. This was amazing. Okay guys, everything is closed. Right now it's 11.40 and uh, I want to eat the shaved ice in Koreatown. But nobody sells any more shaved ice. But I found something at 7-Eleven. So in here we got strawberry condensed milk shaved ice. So I will end this video with this dessert and then it's time to go home. Perfect, this is the humanity is so freaking high. Mm. Oh wow. This is so delicious. For 150 yen, definitely I will buy me this again. For sure, in Koreatown you will become a big cup. But you have to pay at least 650 to 1000 yen. Mmm. <laughs> Amazing. So, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I will call this a quit. I ate more than enough and not in about six hours. I feel pretty satisfied. Right now, it's time for a break and then it's time to record another video. So I will go to Lawson and we'll pick up a lot of stuff and we'll make it Lawson dinner video. Just to let you know, stay tuned for this video. But first I will eat this ice cream and then I have to make a break. So I will walk right now home guys. I hope you liked the video and don't forget if you're new, subscribe to my channel. And don't forget to follow me on Instagram to be updated all the time what I do in Japan. Especially also in the week. Don't forget to comment, like, share, subscribe if you like the video. I'm out guys. I hope it was enjoyable. Oh, I'm pretty full but I feel so good. So see us in the next video. So stay tuned. Sayonara. <laughs>